I'm embarrassed for you. Uh, we're starting off with season three. Season three. We're, on, we're talking about episode one. Uh, yeah. Bert Peterson, head of accounts, gets fired. Have you ever been fired? I have not been fired. Not been fired. Okay. Have you been fired? Shockingly, no. <laughs> Let's say you have been fired. What's a great way to go out? Because we see Bert Peterson in this episode go out with a fucking bang. I've always wanted to flip a table. Well, yeah, that'd be great. There's a lot of appeal in exposing myself. <laughs> this is, no. Would you like... Peeing on something? Oh, would you... Know. Would you... Would you jack off? What would... I, uh, I don't think so. You Maybe. Would, that's an anger erection right there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that what? would be so scary! What other kinds are there? <laughs> Back to Mad Men. Whip out one boob, maybe? I could do that. I feel like it would be pointy if I, like, whipped out one boob. Like, just like, what? Like, what the hell is that guy doing? Just, <laughs> like, not say a word. Be like, okay. Ooh, that would be a really... Cause that's just weird. Yeah, that's weird. It's like, weird. is he gonna come back? Is that what he's gonna do? Uh, Brett Peterson gets fired. Sal and Don have to go to the classic city of Baltimore. Baltimore. City of cities. Thing with Sal and the Bellboy. Mm. Very similar to my problem with Brokeback Mountain, which is that there's little to no words between them, and then all of a sudden they're like doing it. Here's the thing though, too. Oh, oh I brought this up last time, didn't I? I went on which the rant. Where if you get into that situation with a guy, wait, no, who? I always tell you this. <laughs> oh, okay. <what? laughs> um, so Don sees Sal, you know. In his predicament with the gentleman. Yeah. Don, Don don't care. Don, don't give a fun. shit. Way too long. That episode sucked. Love Among the Ruins. This episode sucks too, right? This episode, yeah. I mean, season three starts off slow. Slow. Yeah, yeah, yeah it works to a fever pitch. Okay. Starring Drew Barrymore. This uh, patio that you die drink from Pepsi mm -hmm. wants to have their commercial exactly like the beginning of Bye Bye Birdie. And everyone's watching this, except for obviously Peggy, who's like yeah. stronger than that. Everyone's watching this in mesmeration. No. Like what was with, like, the pointy boobs? That was, bras were like that. I know, but why? Just poor design, or, like, was I, that the I style? think it was poor design. Poor design. Grandpa Jean moves in. Moves into the Draper house, much yeah. to Betty's brother's protest. Protests. Yes, protests. <laughs> protest and mesmerizations. <laughs> this theory. Um, the old... Exologist, Korean Buzzfeeder Jack Moore told me this theory. Fuck that guy. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Jack Moore. <laughs> Gene may or may not have touched uh, Sally Draper. Mm, sorry. sorry, do you have a call? I got, you I got important business, sorry. Sure. So Don goes to some May Day. Why don't we celebrate that anymore, by the oh, way? Oh, it seems so sweet, yeah. Uh, something where his, his lisping little Sally is doing Dance Around the Maypole, and he looks at her teacher, and she's barefoot. Oh. And oh my god. She's thoughtful, and empathetic, and sympathetic, and copacetic. <laughs> Whatever, let's move on. My old Kentucky home. My Blackface. Um, um, Roger is having a party with Jane, because Jane is drunk as shit. Betty goes super pregs, but she looks great. She looks great. This drunk guy, handsome fella, comes up to her. Is he handsome? He's weird looking to me. Hi, I'd like to touch your pregnant belly. <laughs> and he just does. I'm gonna blame this on, oh, on how yeah. drunk I am. But then, you know, PK's like, Trudy, would you like to dance? It's like, okay. Oh no, we're gonna fucking dance. The most intense Charleston <laughs> I've ever seen in my we're life. Peggy and high. the creative team yeah. have to work over the weekend. Peggy just goes, I'm so high right now. Yes. Uh, we got an episode four. Why not? Let's do it. The arrangements. The arrangements. Fathers. <laughs> Fathers. Fathers. <laughs> well, my friend Ho Ho over here. Yeah. Well, like, he's got uh, all this money that he's investing in high lie. And while those other sports, they don't have patches. <laughs> if you were left handed, they would change you to make you right handed. Oh. My mom had that happen to her. I'm yeah. sorry? I know. It's the worst. <laughs> now she's in mental hospital. Gene. Fathers. Oh, speaking of fathers, one of them dies. The Gene CNN does. guy just like collapses. It is kind of sad. Sal's wife knows he's gay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sal's wife knows he's gay when he performs the entire play of <laughs> Bye Bye Birdie. I think maybe season three's theme song should be Father Figure by George Michael. Fa no, be good. Be good. What else do we have? That's pretty much it. Well, that was like a rambling one. There's maybe some good stuff in there. I picture, I like honestly picture Jack Moore like 
So his apartment now is like he takes an elevator up and the elevator literally opens oh, to his apartment. Into his apartment. Yeah, and there's just pad. There's just, just, just wi- and there's women everywhere. Women. And there's just everything's white. How was your day? 